Hello again, Doc on the Clock with more Maternal Bound Redux. Uh, we have just arrived in Moonside. Where yes is no, the graphics and the graphics are trippy. If only that wasn't the best thing I could say about it. And we have gasoline pumps that are attacking us. Yes, this is what Moonside is. Uh, you want to beat these guys quickly. Otherwise, they're going to throw a bomb at you, and it's going to be painful. Yes is no, and no is yes. It makes perfect sense in Moonside, and nowhere else. Moonside is one of the, the more famous uh, sequences of this game. It's also probably one of my least favorite. I mean, I like the weirdness of the aesthetic and everything, but it is a grind to get through. There is... The enemies are not easy. Uh, they will time kind of suddenly warp out of existence. Which will cause me accidentally to get caught from behind. And we don't have our, uh, one of our best damage dealers. Yeah, we are being welcome to Moonside. At the very least, we got in first on this one. Problem is, we have the fire plug, which is also painful. Fortunately, it's dodgy. It can be dodged, but... Everything hurts here. There are tons of enemies right there. I need to go somewhere else. Uh, I need to go farther away from this. How can you dislike burger? Burger is love, burger is life. There's a wall here. I can't get that gift. I'm not looking for the gift. I am looking for... A hotel! How did I get behind that? I'm pretty sure it was the one chasing me. Yeah, good sense. Everyone is someone, don't you think so? Remember, yes is no and no is yes. Do you have anything of useful of use to say? No, you don't. My HP is fine, don't worry. That guy is just threatening me. Fortunately, we can still call people as we normally do. Uh... This guy will sell us a few items, fortunately. I do want to sleep. I need the sleep. Well, yes, that is what the mornings sound like in Moonside. Okay, I will be probably going back to the hotel multiple times. Oh yeah, it's always the middle of the night. That's why morning sounds like this. 
So clearly, Mani Mani is a thing here. But that sounds like something we have to fix. Maybe that we'll be able to fix it at the hospital. Or maybe we'll just get attacked by art in the hospital. There is basically no safe place in Moonside. Abstract art might be the least dangerous enemy here, which is saying a lot, because it's not exactly not dangerous. Interestingly enough, and perhaps fittingly enough, the healer is the main focus uh, in this place. I knew it. I'm just not always good about uh, responding that way. Alright. So, you've seen a lot of these Hawaiian shirt guys around. They teleport you. Before I go teleporting, I want to get whatever I can get. You are extremely forgetful. That seems like it could be a problem in your life. Maybe he's one of those people who has, uh, retrograde amnesia. Or, not retrograde, interrograde amnesia. He might have actually all of the amnesias. Alright. Oh, yeah. There's one guy that, uh... Isn't a Hawaiian shirt guy that warps us. Actually, there's maybe two guys like that. But sending, sending us to the hospital when we're right at the hospital is not exactly uh, helpful. Now again, I wouldn't call all those teleporter guys helpful in the first place. That's very random, and very nonsense. That's Moonside for you. Someone has an obsession with bones. And these gasoline pumps are just trying to cause trouble for me. Yeah, everything here is very, uh, very drug trippy. <laughs> it's meant to be. The problem is, it's also kind of annoying to get through because of how, uh, abstract it is. It's one of those cases where the aesthetic is fantastic. The gameplay leaves a little bit to be desired. It's the Montoli building. You gotta get there. It's me, a guy with a gold tooth and a unibrow, huh? That's random. He's just taking damage. He's counting his HP. It's lucky he has that much. He must have some pretty good vitality. But he probably should heal before he uh, dies.
Yeah, yeah, there are invisible walls everywhere. It's hard to figure out where to go. That extra damage might have been pretty useful. Okay, got rid of the enraged fire plug. It's tough. You gotta know. You gotta measure when to use your uh, PK powers here because uh, it can get uh, kind of expensive. Oh hey, we can auto win the dolly clock battle. Yeah, you see a bunch of uh, Warper guys around here. I feel there's a ton of lag around here. I don't remember the lag being this bad. Part of the problem is that there are a lot of enemies spawning here. Go faster! Okay, I need to stay at the hotel again before I go warping around. There are items to get here. I need to make sure I get them all. That guy never has anything different to say as far as I know. So, okay. Whoa. Beat him up! Beat him up! Stop the damage! Uh, there are entirely too many enemies around here. I want to beat them up before they catch me. As, you can, as we saw earlier, they can kind of... Uh, ambush you if they if you aren't careful. Their movement patterns are bizarre and inscrutable. I mean, they aren't bizarre and inscrutable as it is, so I suppose that makes sense, but still. Okay. There's a teleporter. There's the most useless teleporter. Okay, so middle guy there takes me down to the uh, Montoli building. Oh, those clocks are just running from us now. I'll take it. Okay. Bottom guy, where do you send me? You send me there. That's... I'm pretty sure... Okay, so there are three guys here. I'm pretty sure they're supposed to send in three different ways. Oh yeah, that's what they can do. They stop time and hit you uh, like two to five times. 
Okay. Oh, there's like oh, there's four guys here. Okay. I'm pretty sure mo they're supposed to send you more different places than this. I'm just getting unlucky. I got ambushed. Okay. Then from the hospital sends me somewhere else. A night pendant? I definitely want that. Okay. I think I have Yeah, I have more HP on. Whoop! That wasn't what I wanted to do. Handbag strap. That doesn't sound very useful. Let's use it. Ah, it's a stunner. But it is gone after one use, so I don't need to think about it anymore. Oh. Uh, well, power level up wasn't as powerful as it could be, but... The IQ is useful. If you say so, lady. I don't particularly mind, but you say so. There is an unhealthy obsession with money, money here. Visible walls everywhere. There's only one place I can go, and that is to talk to this guy. Oh. And to actually teleport. Yeah, he is very busy doing nothing. Of course we can see you. Where I have to go. Oh, I'm not finding a door. Oh, he just sends me out back to the hotel. Oh, but there is a guy following us. <laughs> I thought Texans were supposed to like fighting. Let's sleep. I'm spending a lot of money on sleeping. He's got a gold tooth. That's uh, somewhat meaningful. And a unibrow, also somewhat meaningful. I need... A secret herb is just a refreshing herb with more power. I need to get that night pendant. Night pendant replaces the great charm. It doesn't have paralysis defense, but it protects against flash. And now we've just got to follow the warp paths. Once again...
And now we are good to go. And we do need to go. Not in that way, but we need to go. But first, we need to beat these guys. I was kind of hoping to get out of this without doing another fight, but it looks like I'm not going to be that lucky. Avoid, avoid, ah. Uh, Joe, you gotta dodge. Alright, well, we've at least dealt with that. And you're gonna take me down to where I need to go, hopefully. Huzzah! That's gonna be interesting to hear. Bourbon, huh? You go right ahead. Alright. I'm pretty sure there's nothing left to get, so after this clock that so rudely interrupted us, we're going to take care of uh, what's going on here. Uh, no, I want this. Here's Monotoli! Don't do anything to me, I am I'm not Monotoli. Uh, but remember, yes is no, and no is yes, and Moonside. Like, you just disappeared. You can't do that. And you can't do that! Oh, this is bad. I think I am likely to need to, uh... Yeah. I'm going to need to go revive and, uh heal up again. I thought we were going to go straight into battle, so I was not prepared for that. Don't you dare! <sighs> Seriously! Heal up. <sighs> Finally, this is why I don't like Moonside. Uh, again, it's a case where the aesthetic is brilliant, the gameplay is blah. Evasive action! Our way is still open, thankfully. Uh, we have to deal with abstract art, but if that's the worst we have to do, then I think we should be fine. any other enemies get to us. It's the money money must statue, and it looks a lot redder and angrier. We attack the statue. It's called the money money devil. I think it mostly does uh, PK attacks, so... Uh, it's got PK Magnet, that's for sure. Uh, 
Oh, oh no, it doesn't. Maybe I was wrong. Maybe I'm thinking of something else. Oh, I does cause paralysis though. That's a problem. Okay, we can still use PK attacks like this, but uh, a secret. Er we have a couple of secret herbs. Those might need to be used. Might also want to use one of these. Oh, that did quite a bit. <laughs> I wasn't expecting that to be that effective. The Mani Mani statue was actually a device that created illusions. Well, that's interesting. Uh, wasn't quite daydreaming, but... Also, you may notice that uh, Doc is moving kind of slowly. Yeah, we're still paralyzed. We need to go see a healer. All right, Applekid, uh, your timing is impeccable. The Gourmet Tofu Machine. That sounds delightful. Strawberry tofu? That sounds even more delightful. Oh, you were unhappy with Scarlet Express? They've never done me wrong. Careless Express? That sounds... bad. <sighs> Applekid, having some issues. And no one here, I think, says anything else, so... There's a monkey! The monkey just blew up! Oh! Back to the desert! Well, that was very strange. Careless Express. Uh, yeah, I, I'm not inspired. You left your frickin' package in the desert? God, God. Apple Kid, do not ever use them again. Oh, you know, I was just going to leave the strawberry tofu behind. But now we have to get it. Who on earth likes something so disgusting? Ugh. All that, and we're still paralyzed! I need to go to the hospital. Uh, that's all for me for now. Until next time, this is Doc. I'll see you later.